Hello everybody. Today we will start new topic in Python, a new chapter which is GUI, Graphical User Interface. We'll talk something, we we'll skip something before talking to GUI. We'll talk about files and inspection. Uh, exceptions sorry files and ex uh, exceptions writing to a text file reading data from a text file or database or something okay you will took this in python will not learn them in this course you will learn them in another course called com215 uh, 1210 programming 2 so in programming 2 you will learn how to write to a text and reading from a text. So we skip it here in Python to avoid repetition. Okay. Okay. Also, object oriented programming, OOP, about objects, classes, methods, inheritance, polymorphism, abstraction, exceptions. We will not learn them in this course also because you will learn them in another course called comp 311 oop okay to avoid repetition and to go through directly to the gui okay so what is gui okay python the advantage of python is offers multiple option for developing gui multiple options in this course, we'll talk, we'll take only one option. Okay. So in Python, you can create graphical user interface application games and many methods. Okay. There are lots of GUI methods in Python, like Tkinter, WX Python, G Java, G Python and so on and so on and so on and so on and you can download from internet many libraries many libraries to create applications okay so we have lot of methods or libraries in python to create application or gui okay tkinter is the most commonly used method Okay, so in this course, we'll take only this one. Okay, we'll not take others, but all are similar, something similar to each other. But the Kinter package or library is shipped with Python as a standard package. So it is the standard library for GUI application inside PyCharm. Okay, so we don't need to install anything to use it. So it's built in graphical library. Else the others, you need to install them to your PyCharm. Okay, but whereas Tkinter, it's built in in your PyCharm. That's and it's most commonly used. Okay, okay, Python with Tkinter is the fastest and easiest way to create the GUI applications. How to create a Tkinter application? The first method, this is the algorithm, importing the module or library called Tkinter. Create the main window called container then add any number of widget widgets to the main one okay we'll talk for each one then apply the event trigger on the widget okay so we have four steps to create any application you need to mention these four importing the library 
creating the main window, the main window where the widgets or graphs or whatever, whatever on it will be on it. Add any number of widgets to the main window, then even trigger the widgets, then make your motion and running and so on and so on and so on. Okay. So this is the main algorithm to or pseudocode or pseudocode. This is a pseudocode how to create an application. Okay, let's start by one. Importing the Kinter is same as importing any other module in the Python code. Okay, just call it. But here in old version in Python, Python 2.x and okay, they use the Kinter capital T. Now, in the new versions of Python 3.x, okay, they replace it by small t. It's it's very important. It's very important. Okay. We want to use small t. Okay. So our version in PyCharm is three point. So we need to use small t Kinter, small t, not capital T. Okay. Just type import tick enter. So first step, we want to include or import the library tick enter. Small t, small t. Now, this is the first step. It's very easy. The second step is there are two main methods. We have two main methods in Py Python used while creating the Python application, which are TK, here we have capital T. Here, this methods or sub function of tick enter. Here we have sub function. Here we have to put it capital T. Don't confuse between the library name tick enter. Tick enter is the model name or library name, small t. Tick enter is always small t. But the Built in function to create this window is capital T, TK. Okay, so it's a little confusing here. The module, oh, sorry, the method is capital TK. Okay, then we have main loop. So when creating a window, we need to add these two methods. Okay, TK capital T, main loop. We'll talk about each one. Now, let's start to create a main window. How to create a main window? To create a main window, Ticketer offers a method TK, screen name, base name, class name, use TK, whatever. Okay. So we need to talk only this time in this lecture only about class name. To change the name of the window, you can change the class name to the desired one. So, so you need to write this m equal tkinter dot tk, as you can see here. m equal tkinter dot tk. Okay, capital T. Here we have capital T. Not small t. Okay. Capital T. So m equal tick enter dot tk. Here we have built in functions inside this library, capital TK, where m is the name of the main, oh, it's variable name, name of the windows, first windows. We can create many windows on the application, many windows. So m you can uh, make it window one window two window three whatever okay so m it's a variable it's optional but we need to do it we need to do it okay so m it's name of the windows object okay m. method main loop what is main loop there is a method known main loop is used when the application is ready to run i want to run our application my application, I want to run the application, I must use main loop command. So main loop 
it's an infinite loop. It's an infinite loop used to run the application. Wait for an event to occur and to process the event as long as the window is not closed, is open. Okay. So first we open the window, then we run, we run the main loop of this window. We run these windows just to uh, to detect any event will happen on any later widget okay so so if you forget to code the main loops or main loop function nothing will appear to the user okay put it after always 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 we put this command main loop put it after the name of the main window object okay okay it's some definitions here just call m dot main loop okay so example for still now we are creating the main window okay and this is the output this is first example so i will repeat what happened to create a standard window any window okay or application starting to create application we want to create first a window to put our objects called widgets. Okay, we'll talk about them later. So widgets, they are objects to put on the window or in your application. So to create application, first, we want to create a window. First, sorry, we want to import the library to enter or else. Second, we want to create a window. Then running that window, running that window. We have three steps before we begin. So, so I will use uh, PyCharm right now and testing. So till now, I want to import T Kinter. Okay. This is the first step. Import T Kinter. Then, then creating a window. So example, window W equal, equal what? T, Kinter, dot, capital T, K. This is the window, okay? I will here, T, Kinter, dot, dot T, K. Optionally, option, option class name equal the title of the window it's optional here okay class name equal it's between parentheses is always our option okay so we can put we can put it or no class name capital doctor imkin k is the K is غيرة. K, K is غيرة. Sorry. K مش T. T is كبيرة وال K is غيرة معك حق. مين معي؟ علي كوك. برافو. حط بونس يا علي. برافو. هون هون حنسميها ويندو 1. أوكي؟ شو الغلط هون؟ هلا نشوف. نرجع نكتب هون إشياء تانية ليتر أون حنكتبها بس ليتشتغل هيدي الويندو لازم نعيط لها باسمها دبليو نعيط لها باسمها دبليو دوت مين لوب اوكي اند ران لنشوف اذا فيها ايرور او لا اوكي ران في مشكله بالكلاس كلاس نيم كابيتال ان هون البايثون البايثون Case sensitive run test. Okay. Shall it our one? Well, title is moon. Okay. Hella, hella, no one. Okay. Hella, no one. Okay. Had on the so all hella. Hella, man, hella, is she all a window? Lenamel application tabana. Yan, mafic amel application. 
ما فيك تعمل ابلكيشن اذا ما بلشت بوندو شو عم بصير؟ عم تقلب هيدي اوكي؟ ما فيك تعمل ابلكيشن بلا ويندو اوكي؟ سو ذيس از ذا مين ستبس امبورت تيك انتر سمول لتر تي دبليو اور الس وات ايفر هير اني فاريبل هير اني فاريبل هير ايكوال تيك انتر دوت كابيتال تي سمول كي اوبشنالي يو كان نيم ذا ويندو class name equal window one this is option number one then write our codes here and we close it we terminate it by w dot main loop and running main loop mean running in infinite loop because when we put widgets the here objects widgets means objects inside this window will be running okay so this is the main three lines Okay. Any question here? Any question? Good. So, till now, we create a window. Now, what about widgets? What are widgets? So, take enter also this library. Okay. Because we have another libraries for graphics this tkinter library provide various control called widgets such as buttons labels combo boxes text boxes and many else used in the gui application we have lot of types of widgets in tkinter we'll begin we have 19 in tkinter we have 19 widgets okay we'll talk about in this course we'll talk about 10 in, around 10 okay so we have 19 widgets which are button to add a button to, to your screen convex to draw to draw in your window uh, lines polygon rectangle uh, circle whatever check button to display a number of options as checkbox. The user can select multiple options at the same time. Entry, it's input. To entry widgets is used to display a single line text for accepting value from the user. So the user will, will input his data via widgets called entry. Of course, we'll test it. Frame. Also, you can make sub window inside a window called the frame. So one window can be divided in many sub windows or small windows called the frame. Okay. Label, just to label. It's a text, just labeling any widgets that you want. But in label command widgets, you can put image and label also. Okay. Now, list box, it's list of options for user. Menu buttons or menu to give you display a menu in your application. We'll took this. Message, it's display a multi-line a multi -line text field for accepting value from the user. So we have entry and we have message. If you want to enter a one line, one variable, one float number, integer, whatever, in your application, you use entry. But if you want to enter a text, a paragraph, a sentence, a whatever, you need to use message as entry message, okay? We have also radio button. It gives you radio button. But here, what is the difference between check button and radio button? Check button. Here, you can, the user can select multiple options at the same time. But in Radio Atom, the users can select only one option at a time. It's deferred because when, when you select, there is a small code to generate, okay? Scale, if I want to move anything inside, slider would. Scroll bar, you know what is scroll bar. 
uh, on the horizontal or vertical, it's a bar to uh, scrolling any widgets you want, okay? Text, just to display text. Top level, here is another option. If I want to split from window to open another window, I can use top level. A spin box. If I want to select a fixed number of values, we'll see it. Panned window. We can put a, a, a widget can be or, uh, arranged as horizontal or vertical. We'll see it in your lab. You will see it in your lab here. Okay. Label frame. We put a label name for any frame we want. And last, which is very important, is small t, capital uh, small t k message box. This module is used to display message box in your application. It's like alert or warning box, message box, okay, to pop up for you. So in our in lecture, I think we'll took around 10. And in your lab, you will took the 19. Okay. So you will take a new discourse with the lab, the 19 example for each one, or combination by two or three. Okay. Okay. Before we begin to add a widget, we need to know as definition what is geometry management. Geometry management methods, which have the purpose of organizing widgets throughout the parent area. When, where I want to put the, the widgets. Where? In the top, in the bottom, in the side, in the middle of the window. Where I can, where I can place my widgets. So this is called geometry management. So we have three classes here, pack, grid, and the place. Pack method means the widget will be placed in the blocks, okay? As a block, we'll take an example. Grid method, the widget will be put it on the window as a table. Pack method, the widget will be put it on the window as a block. A grid method as a table. A place method in a specific position. Here, you want to give uh, the code, the X and Y coordinate. Here with X, Y, to put this widget as X and Y position, and a, an exact position that you want, okay? So you can use one of them. Okay, auto arrangement here as a block or as a table, column by column here. Okay, here as a block diagram, as a block. We'll took three methods. Now, the first application, we'll do it right now. Okay, is adding a button. And we'll end this lecture. To add a button in your application, the general syntax is any variable that you want, any variable that you want here, equal capital B, capital B button, capital B button, master comma option value. Master here, it's the main window, the parent window. Just call your window that you want to add this button. So you want to add a button, capital B, call your window one or your main window here, then many options. The options are, Okay. This option will change the format of the button. Okay, and make and put it as comma separator. R. One of the options are text to display your text on the button. Active background to change the background color of the text. Active foreground to change the color of the text. Background color. Command to call a function from a button. When anyone presses this button, we have command 
uh, option to open a function or to open another application, to open another window, another button, another whatever. It's function. We'll use it. We'll use it. Font to change the font of image. You can put image on your button and width and height. Okay. So you can, all of these are options. Okay. You can use one of these as option to create a button. Okay. Text, font, image, width, height, command to call another button or another function, background colors, and, 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 and. okay? So let's try first code. Adding a button, code number one, or example number one. So we can do it at another thing. We can binding names for module. If you remember in our last lectures, binding names for modules, we can use this. Import tkinter as t alias to avoid write always tkinter tkinter dot. So just write t dot pk. And we can put a title. We can use the class name inside it or put a title. R dot title, you can put whatever you want here. Then I want to create a button. Button equal T dot capital B button are the main window here. This is the main window here are, and you can write a text on the bottom. Text equal stop with 25 column equal R dot destroy. It's a built-in function to exit. Then here for each button, for each widget, you need to put geometry button dot pack as a block diagram then r dot main loop this is the code that we want to do it right now okay to give you this okay this is the first code okay so the same as before i want import tkinter as small t here to avoid writing always tick enter tick enter tick enter just write t tk i want leave class name and and w dot title between parentheses i want to add uh, another title here what will happen will be overwrite or no we'll test it okay and we have w dot main loop is always. Now I want to create a button. Let's say B equal capital B button. Here it's obligatory to call on which window. When did you put the button? Did you put the W? Come on. Show option in the alba. Text equal. Write your text here. Example stop example stop another option if i want we can okay here but here i want to t dot button okay t dot button always call the library then the method here where i put this button i don't want to put right now button dot pack what will happen let's see what will happen nothing display okay nothing display here okay i need as you can see class name window one w dot title another title so the title method will override the class name okay will override the class name okay so you can do one of them one of them it's enough okay now the bottom is not show is not showing because we don't specify where we put it, where we put it. So we want to put always, always B dot pack or, uh, or place all grid, okay? Right now we'll use pack as a block diagram. So stop and run, as you can see, 
خلاص صغيرة هيا حطها بالنص دوت باك حطها بالنص از بلوك ديجرام اوكي از بلوك ديجرام طب اذا استعملت بليس او جريد بدل باك في حتى جريد تنشوف وين بتطلع هذه جيومتري بس وين بتطلع طلعت على الطرف از تيبل از تيبل ببلش first column second column third column okay as table okay fina hon natiha width equal 50 okay hon shuf shu bisir yinke bada capital letter la zabat okay had the 50 So uh, 50 pixels, okay? How on Khalia pack? Ahsan. Tutla bin nos ahsan. Okay? Okay? So, adding two bottoms, adding two bottoms, okay? How we can add two bottoms? The same. Here we have one bottom, here we have two bottoms. Take enter as T, the same. Okay. Bottom number one and bottom number two, the same. Okay. Example here, R dot destroy. I want to use this. Here, comma, command equal. Here, which, which I want to exit. Which window I want to close, W. The window. It's called W here. Dot, we have many things. Quit, destroy, quit, destroy, exit. We have many functions, built-in functions here. Okay, let's try it. Error, nothing. We remove this parenthesis. Later, I will talk about that, okay? So we have here, if I want to click stop, will be exit. Okay, so we make a function, we call a function. Okay, we have less one minute. I can put another when bottoms here, B2, B2. Here we have another, quit. Okay, here we have battle destroy, quit. Okay, running, we have two buttons, quit and stop, okay? Any question? We finish our lecture today, okay? Test them in your home. Any question? Good. No, doctor. Good.